Hey, I'm Captain Todd Jones with your half hitch tackle tip. Today's tip is going to be rigging a basic trolling rig for kings. This is about a 90 pound wire. And first thing I'm going to do is rig my hooks. So I use two long shanked hooks for this. And I get a pair of side cutting pliers. And right here where the hook goes together, I just spread that eye out just a little bit just enough to get to get our hook in there. So then we're going to do another haywire twist onto here. And there's a couple variations in, in, as far as these rigging these two hooks and I'll show you both of them. The first one is just going to be a basic cigar minnow rig. So we're going to get our haywire twist, three to five twist, and then barrel wraps. Same thing, about three to five barrel wraps. Then make our 90 right here and break our wire off. Just a little bit heavier wire, but it still breaks pretty easy. And the way you put this on is you actually put the long side up because that, then that way it pulls down like this over the, uh, over the cigar minnow. So we're going to stick this in here right through the, through the hole. It's going to come down right onto your hooks like this. What we are going to add to this is a swivel, just a standard barrel swivel. Again, haywire twist, three to five wraps. Finish it off with a barrel wrap. Again, three to five barrels. Bend your 90, break your wire. This is your standard trolling rig right here for a cigar minnow. And the way you would hook this is you would just place this top hook right underneath the cigars, his chin go up right in between the eyes like that. And this is going to add a little bit of flash to it and it's also going to let it troll a little bit longer. And you can troll a live cigar minnow or a dead cigar minnow on this. You know, if they're out of live cigar minnows, do not be afraid to go out there and just troll with, with dead cigar minnows. I do it all the time, and I'm very successful with it. The next rig that I'm gonna show you is basically the same thing. It's just a variation in the way you attach it. This is for a bonita strip, or a dolphin strip, or anything like that. So, as you can see, I've just removed moved my hooks. I'm going to retie these hooks on here with a haywire twist. This time, I'm going to go out a little bit longer with this. I'm going to do my do my haywire my twist, a couple barrel wraps. Except for when I get to the end of these barrel wraps, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look and see how my uh, hooks sit. And you can see how the hooks go right here with the eye. So with this, the important thing is to have this in line with the way the, the hook is laying right here. So with that, we're going to bend it right here. Then we're going to twist this way. And we can actually cut this with a pair. We don't have to break this, we'll just twist this up close. And now you, you have a little place right here like a hanger, a pin, to hang your strip. So you take a bonita belly strip or a mahi belly strip or even one of the artificial ones and you can put on here. So you would attach this to the top of the strip and it would hang off of here. Then you would put this hook into one and then this into the other part of the strip. And same thing just a basic trolling rig.